We will now use an option called Elemental Triads, which will show us the local coordinate systems for each gauge. This will make analyzing our results much easier. So we right-click on Solution, Insert, Coordinate Systems, and Elemental Triads. We can see that all bodies are selected, but we only want to select one body per elemental triad, which will be our specific surface body. So let's use the body selection tool and select one of our gauges. I'll first zoom in a bit. Okay, so when you click on it, you'll see that you will likely not be able to select your gauge right away. But you can make use of the layer icons on the left corner of the window to help you select the right body. And then click here, apply. And let's do the same thing for the other two surface bodies. And now click Solve. And you may get some warning messages, but don't worry about these. Um, it simply means that um, you know some of your previous answers can overlap on the string gauges in. They might not be the correct results, but um, it's fine. You can simply click uh, on the Details tab instead. And I'll click on Elemental Triads.